Hi there, I'm just making this video today to show off an issue that I've been having with um, fonts on Windows and I found a solution to it, it took me a really long time to do so I'm just making this video to bring awareness to it and if you're having the same problem maybe this will help you. So. I'm a graphic designer and um, the company that I work for uses Accidents Grotesque as a heading font and so if I click on this now as you can see I've got it set to this font here um, but I'm having a bit of an issue where I can't change to a regular version of the font so I've got medium italic, bold italic um, and uh, just bold. Um, now the thing is I should have medium italic and I should also have regular um, but I don't and uh, you might be thinking that I've installed the font wrong, but I haven't. And if I go into InDesign, um, it's exactly the same. So if I just click on this now and a little drop down, yeah, medium italic, bold and bold italic, no regular, no medium italic. Um, so yes, anyway, so um, I'll just show you. I've got the fonts here now and regular, double click on it, click install. It's telling me it's already installed, it's not. If I Try, let it try and install. It doesn't do anything. I open in design. You can restart the program. It doesn't work. Um, there's another option where you can do hold Windows key and R, put on shell fonts and click drag everything in. It'll tell you uh, to replace it. Say yes. And then once it's done, uh, you can search for uh, you can search for it. As you can see, it hasn't got them, even though it's you. It says you've added them and they're already there. Anyway, so to fix that, I found a strange solution that uh, took me a while to find, uh, and that is first of all, you need to go to your PC, uh, go to your C drive or the drive which you've installed um, your Adobe on. Um, actually, I think it would just be in C drive. I'm not sure. Uh, go to Program Files, go to Common Files, and then literally go to Adobe and make a, a new folder and just call it fonts. Now in this case I'm not going to do that I'm going to just move in a fonts folder that I've already prepared so I've got Accidents Grotesque, I've got Helvetica and I've got other. You can just folder these fonts and they'll work fine um, and then so we can just click drag those into here it'll ask for admin permissions just click yes and then we should just be able to open these up now if it doesn't show it straight away, what we can do is we can just close these. Let's say no. And then open up the PSD again. Wait for Photoshop to finish loading. Okay, highlight it. Drop down. There it is. Regular. Works fine. Don't ask me why. That's just the way it is. Um, so I hope that you found this helpful uh, if you're having the same issue. I don't know why I was having this issue. Um, but uh, I couldn't find much help online either. There we are. Thank you for watching.